think for a moment we are on a donut pilgrimage and we are not alone. How far did you come from? Palm Springs. Palm Springs. Yes, it's about two hour, two hour drive. Donut Man is open 24 seven and churning out donuts here 20 hours a day. So chances of getting a warm one like this little number called a buttermilk bar, pretty good. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's worth the trip. The none too fancy facade masks what for many is donut Xanadu. If you're gonna be in Southern California, where else do you go? Especially for one of the best donut there is. Jim Nakano first opened this place almost 50 years ago. What is the secret to your donuts? We use the best ingredients and they're hand produced. No machines here, no shortcuts, potato flour and more for the dough, and a stubborn insistence on quality. Really stubborn. It's very important to us to try to use the best ingredients and just stay with that standard. Yeah. Hard headed. Hard headed. Hard headed. <laughs> Long before there was such a thing called a designer donut, Jim started turning out these beauties during strawberry season. They tickle the eye and delight your tummy. I can't eat the whole thing at one time like I used to, but right. uh, feel free. All right, I'm going to try this. Okay, now, if you drop one, you're a rookie. Isn't that good? Oh my God. Despite decades of success, Donut Man has never expanded. But Jim's Donuts are soon to debut at LA's famed Grand Central Market. How proud are you of what you've been able to accomplish? I never looked at it that way. I'm very happy for our success, and I think it's because of other people. But hard work and determination are a small part of Jim's story. As a child, Jim was a prisoner of the United States. He and more than 100,000 Japanese Americans. We lost everything. Jim's family was interned. After the war, Jim graduated college and served in the Navy, eventually starting a business and opening Donut Man. We started a business and we made American Dream. You heard that right, the American Dream. I just feel fortunate, very fortunate. Where there may have been bitterness, there is only the sweetest of stories here. For what, after all, is a donut other than a few moments of pleasure? That is, if you have just one. So how many did you get? I got four. Three for me, one for my dad. <laughs> <laughs> for Sunday Today, Harry Smith, Glendora, California.